Tonight will be week two of Friday Night Lights at 1030 on Fox 12, but it's not all football all the time. Yeah, Fox 12's Nick Krupke has today's high school spotlight on a three-sport standout from Vancouver who spent the month of July far from the Pacific Northwest to get closer to her roots during the Pacific Games in American Samoa. There are lone wolves, but it's always better to travel in a pack. Here at Heritage High School, the Timberwolves are lit out of the den by an alpha, now wearing a gold medal. I didn't really want to go tell everybody, like, hey, I won a gold medal this summer. I just don't want to be that type of person to, like, push it on people. Okay. <laughs> Humble pride. I never thought I would be able to represent a whole, like, nation of people. 16-year-old Heritage High School junior Katie Penawena spent three weeks of summer vacation by celebrating her Samoan heritage. The Samoan tradition is to like hug and like give a little kiss to everyone you meet and it was just interesting like just hugging everyone, <laughs> everyone that I met. The six foot two T-Wolf star was invited to play for American Samoa, U.S. territory island of some 55,000. The Pacific Games is the youngest baller on the roster. I'm so used to like club ball, it's really fast. There's just a lot of quick movements and everything. But the thing with like playing with grown women, they're very like methodical about their play and they just take their time and they find the right plays. They don't rush things. Katie earned the start in the gold medal game and it was pure bliss. Once we got back into like the locker room, that's when that's when the tears started coming. <laughs> yeah. Fall brings a change of scenery from fast breaks to bump set spike. Volleyball is kind of like my getaway from basketball. I mean, I still try to like go put shots up and get workouts in on the weekends, but I really enjoy like the fun of volleyball. It's really not as much stress as basketball. Penny Weta is being heavily recruited to hoop it up by multiple Division I colleges, but that education is the golden ticket. It's definitely a little like stressful, but at the same time, it's really humbling to realize that all the opportunities that I have and I just have to think back on it and like thank God for all the blessings that I've received. What do you want to do? I want to be a forensic pathologist. Oh, okay. Yeah. What does that entail? Uh, so basically it's the person that uh, is in charge of the autopsy after like a crime scene. So you're basically finding out like what happened, kind of who the killer is. I mean, is it just like Netflix wants you to do that? What, what, what you want to do I that? honestly kind of think it's because I just like grew up with my grandma watching like Law and Order SVU all the time and Criminal Minds. I was just growing up watching that with her and I think it just kind of stuck in my head that I want to do that. Week two of Friday Night Lights is tonight at 1030 and be sure to submit those high school spotlight ideas like Katie. That's how we found our way here to Heritage High in Vancouver. Nick Krupke, Good Day Oregon.